Hey guys, so welcome, welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles. Let's carry on where we left off. We're inside the Mechonis, having dealt with the Apocrypha Generator. And now all that's left to do is to clean up Egil once and for all. Dixon and Albus are with us. Let's see if they can contribute towards our efforts to save the Bionis and the people aboard it, considering it's already taken a stab wound. Apologies if I do sound a little bit different. I am combating a sore throat. So this may be a shorter episode this time around, but... Yeah, so we gotta progress the story, man. Have finally arrived. <laughs> Tab straight. Stop the McConnus has tapeworms, and we're there. There has them. to be a way for us to live in peace. There's no reason for us to fight. You must stop this now. My reasons are clear and truer than yours. Well, I was hoping he'd surrender to a bunch of us while he's piloting Yaldabaoth. Oh May my the God. Roar of the McConnus. Be the wrath of my people. Oh, he's going for another stab wound. Damn it, Bionis. Wake up. Feed off the people. We've returned to you. How many? Huh? How many do you think died in that attack? Hundreds? Maybe thousands? Bloody hell, this guy. They're just a statistic. Hundreds or thousands of people died. I think that's what he wants, the mayor. I will end our curse by destroying the world. You must realize <laughs> that is not Lady Maynard's wish. That's why she left us her legacy, our whole world. Whoa! Pure Bloody nonsense. hell! That thing lurking within the Homs girl is no longer our god. He beats to the sound of his own drum. This world no longer has a need. Oh God. I mean, you're the one piloting Yeldabaoth, so... I'll crush the Bionis and spread its ashes across the world. Goodness. Then I'll turn the Monado into dust. Only then will there be peace. <laughs> There'll be peace when half the world has been exterminated and there's no one around to challenge my authority. Okay, well, uh... <laughs> I guess we stick with the same party. It worked out last time, and I'm quite happy with this arrangement for now. Yaldabaoth, level 72. Fantastic. The odds are stacked against us. Okay. Let's take this on. Obviously, we can't get too close. Oh, it's actually losing quite a bit of health. Right quick. <laughs> He's not exactly doing anything. He's just tanking it. What a chad. Okay. Oh, uh, chastise. Here we go. We're about to get lectured. Oh, really? A bind? Come on! There we go. I was wondering where the debuff immunity was going to come into play. Oh, holy shit. Okay. Thank you for the heals. I'll take that. Okay, he's really not doing too much to us, thankfully. I just realized I shouldn't have enchanted the first time around because I don't need to. Well, at least uh, Charlotte can do some headshots here and there. Uh oh. He's making some cronies. We might have to deal with them. There they are. Well, he's down to half. Let's get rid of these exterminators. Can't even tell which one I'm targeting. Ugh. Uh oh. What do we got? Big spin. On Fiora, she's going down unless Charlotte can save her. Let's see. Looks like, uh... Oh, wow. Not only has she changed the target, it's gonna miss! With the increased agility. You'll love to see it. Uh, let's focus our attacks, please. I wanna get rid of these ads. ASA possible. Yeah, lined up. For a collat. Holy shit! Um... Bionis Slash! The Bionis gonna take damage! What do we do here? <laughs> okay, it's gonna do infinite damage. 120 seconds, okay. The goddess is being operated by Yaldabaoth. Stop its attack on the Bionis. Defeat the three energy devices around it. Yaldabaoth. Okay. Okay, so we can run on this. Come on guys, let's go, let's go, let's go! <laughs> Okie dokie, yeah, okay. I suppose we can destroy these energy devices. Okay, one down. 
Oh god. I just realized my team's dead. What are you guys doing? Uh oh, I didn't mean to warn her. But, uh, sure, why not? Kill yourself. Ow. Oh. oh god. Thank you. I'm dazed. Pick me up. Oh god. Oh, I can't pick her up. Oh, this is a disaster. God, nothing's gonna stop us except for the slow debuff. And a topple on top of that. What the hell happened? We just all went down at once. I probably shouldn't have prioritized the energy devices. I needed to get rid of the ads first. Let's do that. God, what is this? Dark Souls? I have to, like, run across the entirety of this bloody corridor just to reach Eggel again. <laughs> the run of shame, if you will, where I have to ponder my strategy and lament the fact that I made dumb decisions. Oh, hey guys, thank you for being useful. Bloody Alvis and Dixon. Are they just waiting for me to take down Eggel so they can enact whatever plans they have? Dixon obviously wants to assassinate Lady Maynith, I think. He doesn't care that it's Fiora that's uh, hosting her, which is unfortunate. That means we're gonna have to stop him. There we go, let's do this again. Okay, we basically caught up. He's manufacturing drones again as he nears half HP. Once again, we're gonna focus attacks here. Starting with this block. Shadow Eye, get rid of our aggro. Just so I can do a backslash. Oh yes, a chain attack would be great right now. Here we go. Nope, he's going after Fiora here. That is a uh, long attack. An art seal. Ow. Damn, I just want to pull off this chain attack here. Uh, fortunately, this guy got an attack off. Uh, you're just going to heal. Now let's do a uh, heal round on everybody. Good. Wow, Eggle sounds very frustrated. Shut down the mech on. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Let's keep this up. Uh, he's not suffering from topple right now. Let's, uh, let's... Oh no, tension's already up. Uh, oh, let's just do a double blade. Okay, still a decent chunk of damage. We've done barely anything. <laughs> we still haven't defeated the boss. And you're about to take a bunch of damage. Because I don't have the enchant to increase your agility yet. Here it comes! Oh, oh, okay. All our arts have been sealed. Except for my Monados, of course. Energy replenish? That doesn't sound good. Damn it! Here we go. Okay, I think we can get ahead of the time limit here. <laughs> I mean, that's pretty cool, like, just seeing this. Uh, pop up in a vision. Like, the world is about to end. Save my honest. I don't know why I warned Pure here. Okay, we need to get rid of these guys first. We've got time. Let's not panic. Guys, uh, they're toppled. Come on, there we go. There we go. 120 seconds. That's two minutes. Come on. Auto attack's not working on this thing? There we go. Oh, damn it. What the hell? Sharla! What are you doing? Now's not the time to be mucking around. Okay. Some encouragement there. Where's this guy going? Oh. Yours taking initiative. Going after the energy source herself. <laughs> and the bits of motors just slowly creeping along. Ugh. Get rid of it. Okay. One to go. 
<laughs> it's just an energy device, but yeah, do go all out. Our world is at risk. Like, what's going on? Whenever it reaches, like, the last little segment of its health bar, it just stops taking damage for some reason. Destroy the energy devices and stop the destruction of Bionis! Yeah, he's dazed. He's dazed. Let's go. Let's go. Chain attack. Go with a buster to start things off. Charlotte, please. Don't walk off the edge. Oh my god. <laughs> we actually missed out. You're kidding me. Okay, well, it's just gonna be us two then. Uh, stream edge. Start building up our Monado. Not bad. Could be better. Would have been great if our healer could contribute something besides saving our lives. You know, because that's not an important job. Okay, plug away at it. He's just chilling right now. I guess he's still trying to work out the controls. Some drones are on their way, but he's almost down, damn it. Uh, let's save that for fighting these things. Lined up. Perfect. Okay, will be a backslash. Nice. Okay. No trouble at all. Uh-oh, here we go again. Damn it, Charla! Have you not figured it out? You can't reach him! <laughs> not so fast, I'm not waiting forever for you to take your turn, damn it. Double blade. How dare I? No, Charla, you don't get to say that. Not after that stunt you pulled. Okay, he's just gonna keep manufacturing drones, trying to distract us. That's not good. Hopefully if we defeat him, uh, we just win outright. There we go. Alright! There you go! I guess you should have turned the Monado to dust first. That would have helped your diabolical plan. Oh, wow. Damn! What a parry! What a parry. Shulk ain't taking shit from no one. Here we go. Shulk, don't do it. Two, I'm in the middle of the air. What do you want me to do? I can't cancel. Wow. How could this happen? Because you barely attacked us. Do it. Whoa. Kill was that? him. Kill oh, him. it's Frostmourne! It's that's talking to me! Strike him down! I will. Is that Zanza? I'll kill him. A thousand times. Whoa. Yes. Joke! Finish no! Him. Drop the sword! End it. it is what you want. Yes. I want to. Someone I'll tackle me! Fiora! For the Emperor. For the Emperor. Drop kick me! For my home! You must find your Monado. Albus? Are, Are you feeling hungry, eh? Chew on this, scrap you for even brain. You kill a homes to beat us. I to kill. I once wished only I to break the circle of suffering. Until oh my God. I believed each and every one of you. Mena, the villagers, everyone loved you. Every person. Yes. That is why they Finish wished him. to live alongside End you. It. The way it is what so you clear. want. To Mena. And to me. <sighs> oh. No. Oh my god. This isn't what I want. Shulk! No! Brother! <sighs> Damn. We stopped ourselves. <sighs> Alright. Let's just chill out for a bit. Why didn't you do it? Killing me would have saved your world. Oh, there'll be plenty of time to kill you later. I've forgotten all about that. <laughs> forgotten about it? I realized that we both share the same pain. Egil, I don't have any reason to kill you. Even if you do not, 
I still do. I know. <laughs> Just but please don't do, do it. it. If you do not kill me now, my blade will annihilate every last one of your people. Why would you say that? You want me Even to kill you? Then. I can't kill you, but I can stop your blade. And I'll do it. Over and over again until... We become my friend. Each other. Okay. <sighs> you have used the Monado well. But do you honestly believe you are its master? No. <laughs> I do not. What are they talking about? I don't know. They're just chilling up there. Maconis and Bionis once lived in harmony. But what they changed? coexisted in peace. Without hatred or strife. Hey, Gil. Why do you think we were born? Ah, philosophy. Alas. I'm not very good at answering such questions. Happier Have times. Have you never thought about it? Never, never contemplated what lies beyond this world? Beyond this world? <laughs> Lady Mayneth once said that aside from the Bionis and the Meconis, this world is filled with nothing but boundless ocean. But what lies beyond, beyond that? that? We are still young and unable to leave the Bionis or the Meconis. Say goodbye to our creators, our world. But one day our descendants will. They will leave this place and depart for new worlds. Worlds we have never imagined by strength of their will alone. Admittedly, this is a world I never leave imagined. this place. That is something I have never considered. However, it would be a truly amazing sight. Hey, Gil. I wish to see that the people of Bionis and the people of Mechonis live in peace and harmony and take care of one another. I wish this for the future of our descendants. Is that truly what you yes. wish for? I too desire this. Arglas. Arglas? Everybody shared Never the mind. belief that the prosperity of our two worlds would continue for all eternity. It would have done, were it not for the Monado. The Monado refused to permit the existence of the Meconis. And that's a part of the, bi rather, the Bionis, right? So the existence of anything but itself. Where did it come from besides that? One day, it took control of my friend, Arglas, and he became Zanza. Ah, I see, okay. So. It was Arglas, possessed by Zanza, who directed his sword at Maconis. So Zanza resides in the sword. I don't understand. Wait, Zanza... Does being controlled oh, okay. by the Monado mean you will eventually become Zanza? That's why the I'm The Monado called. is Zanza. Zanza is the Monado. The two are one and the same. In order to perpetuate the existence of his soul, Zanza inhabits beings of Bionis. So who is but Zanza? Zanza you Zanza? You appear to be different. What do you mean? I can see it. How well you retained a sense of self. Perhaps you can break the curse of Zanza. And was that not precisely our wish, Lady Mayneth? I don't know much about any curse. For now, all I can do is this, Egil. We can live in peace again. Again? Yep. I see. After you Yes, face. you're right. The music for what you've just done to the Bionis, killing thousands of people. Oh! What? Why did I get shot? I thought they were gonna go after Eagle at the very least. <gasps> no! Uh, Who the hell? Dixon? Dixon! 
There we go. You shouldn't have done that, little brat. What? Shulk! Uh oh. True colors revealed at last. Ah! I was gonna say, catch me, please. Dixon, why? Why, old man? Are you completely out of your mind? You should have gone for the head, Dixon. Ah, don't you kids ever shut up? Are you I'm just okay? Doing my job, as always. Are you possessed? Who are you? It. It's you. Him. What? No. Yes. Now you remember. It's been a long time, hasn't it, Eggle? Too long. Huh? Zanza's disciple. <sighs> Zanza's disciple? No, I'm too sick for Dixon, this. What do you mean? Dixon, what are you? I don't Zanza's have disciple. to explain anything. As they say, seeing is believing. Now, witness it oh my with God, your own I'm eyes. Convulsing. The moment of Lord Zanza's return. Oh! Shulk! Get away from him! No! Oh god! Zanza. This was not on my bingo card for Zeta Blade. You do this. God! My plot just keeps one upping itself. Holy shit! Oh, God. Brother! <clears throat> Wait, well, who's this guy? There's Zanza. Zanza. And the flesh. Do not be surprised. Oh, my God. Everything in this world is dictated by the passage of fate. Zanza's liquid snake! As all that exists is interconnected. Time can flow only towards the inevitable. Why do I look like him? That's why I'm the heir. Ah! That is the vision of which I, the Monado, am the origin. That which will be, will be. I wonder if this is when... This was all predestined. No, Ever hang on. since I came to reside within Shulk. What do you mean? During that expedition in the snow. Zanza grew tired from our battle. And then the High Entia ancestors trapped him. His flesh was sealed away on Prison Island. His soul. That would be Arglas. Hence the Monado was confined to Ossie Tower. So they were separated. But well, what does this have to do with Shulk? And Dixon Did you actually was going to rescue Zanza, I'm guessing now, because he's Zanza's disciple. He didn't chance upon Shulk. Who discovered those ruins? And that's why he took such an interest in looking after Shulk, probably because Who he looked like be Zanza. There? Who was the survivor we found? And who brought back that survivor? You've just been what biding you your saying? time. You planned all this when you found Shulk. Jackpot. I shouldn't have trusted him ever since I saw those pants. Day. In fact, there was never anyone called Shulk to begin with. What? <laughs> My soul existed inside the Monado. Even my name's made up! It was fated that I'd be released. It was shown to me in a vision. At last the time finally came. But what do you want? Then, oh my god, this is fantastic. The and freed it, awoke Sansa. He sucked the lies from them, so he could live. Shulk was among them. Right. Shulk was already dead! That's impossible! We grew up together! Oh, you grew no. up with an empty shell. A husk. He appeared to live because I became his life force. Oh, the zombie! That is until he had matured as my new vessel and become worthy of wielding the Monado. That's why I never had any issues wielding it. truly awaken and finally return. Lord Zanza is the soul of the Bionis, but he still needs a living body. So Zanza and Lady Maneth. Like Maneth over yeah. there. Okay. Hang on, I'm trying to wrap my head around all this. Okay, so I always assumed Arglas was Zanza. That's why I was like, how did Arglas, well, you know, Zanza, get into Shulk and whatnot? Now I understand that he was just possessed. <laughs> Call that corpse a friend. Don't make me laugh. But why use Shulk? What was it that made you select Shulk as your vessel? 
Damn. There was no particular reason. Melia was falling for him. Shulk merely happened to be there at the time. There you have it. Anybody would have done. As long as they could swing a sword around, at least. So then... But Shulk just happened to look up. To, use the to look like and him? those visions that he used to save us. All because of Lord Zanza. <coughs> Lord Zanza can see the passage of fate. He simply led you to the inevitable. The destruction of Colony 9. The death of that pompous old high entier fool. Oh, and God. that grunt Gado's miserable demise. <laughs> All of it. Dixon! Evil! Yeah! God, another shot of Melia. I should change There's her outfit. More. We haven't even got to the best part. What are you gonna do, Dixon? Don't you get it? You're just in the way. But what's your end game you. here? This world was created by Lord Zanza. By the very Bionis itself. Then you things think you can just spring up all over the place. All life that is born from me must be returned to me eventually to complete the cycle. For me to continue my existence as before, then all must be restored to its former order. In other words, the destruction and recreation of the world. Oh, you want to start again? Nothing more to it. The Great Flood and all that? First, we must eliminate my greatest obstacle. You, Maynith. The Maconis! Okay. Uh oh. Uh, I should have. I should have got the Bionis to stay asleep. I regret everything. Bionis moves. It's beginning. I've been waiting, waiting for this day. Sansa! Oh, here we go. <laughs> Except Eggle's new at this. Brother, stop! You're too weak! Yeah, I, I was gonna say. Care. I will gladly sacrifice myself to eliminate Xander. As long as he lives, there can be no peace for us or for the people of Bionis. Unfortunately, I think this has all been planned out to perfection. Ha! Then you shall cease to exist. The guy can see the future. By the wrath of my blade. Oh my god. It's... The Monado. My voice is gonna be shot to shit once this is all done. I'll show you the meaning of wrath. Oh dear. Hey, Gil. Why do I feel like he's gonna get obliterated? What? Here he comes. Oh my god. There goes the sword and the head. Damn, he just wiped him out. Egil and Shulk could put their differences aside. Meaningless sentiment. Shulk doesn't exist. Right, now, yeah. How could you do this? It is from me that all life is born. Why aren't you just it a cocky little shit? For me, and it shall be returned. Oh god, he's gonna kill us all! Maynith! Do something! There we go! Oh, destined to do battle. Okay, she stopped the sword for now. So you have finally unleashed your Monado. And there was me thinking you would die with dignity. I would say fighting back is dying with dignity. Understand. The futures of our children belong to them alone. Though we are their creators, their lives are theirs to control. Even if the passage of fate is, this as is so you have cool. decided. I will teach you the strength of their will to resist. I'm smiling like a 
fucking goofball right now. <sighs> Epic showdown time. If you choose to deny the existence of every living being but yourself, well, you're gonna be a lonely man. To fight. to fight for them. That's right. We won't let you erase everyone's futures. Are we doing this? Are we doing this? We're fighting. This battle is mine, Maynard. Uh, <laughs> his level far exceeds my own, and I'm fighting him by myself here. Monado Buster. Ah! Go to sleep. Is that all you've got? Well, it's not like you're doing much damage to me either. Is that all you've got? Zero gravity. <laughs> Second gear? Give it everything I've got. Uh oh. Is that all you've got? I am actually doing damage to him, so there's that. Fortunately, I've got no way of healing. Is that all you've got? Invincible. Fantastic. Maybe it's a good thing I deleted that armor art then. <laughs> Instead of loading it onto my Monado. Ah. No, we're not really, are we? Run! Where is everybody? Oh my god, they left me to die! How could they? Is that all you've got? Is that all you've got? Jeez, I didn't realize the final boss battle would be myself! Wow, okay, well, that ship sunk. I think, Melia, I think you're all good. Maybe you dodged a bullet here. I think these two have got some domestic issues they need to sort out. We're not getting anywhere. We're I don't know, I think Zanza's getting somewhere. Got? We're down to 37 health. Now one, Is obviously. That all you've got? We're kept alive here. Urgh. Is that all you've got? 13,000 damage. Is that all you've got? Is that all you've got to say? Is that all you've got? I think so. <laughs> Is that all you've got? I guess we just gotta do enough damage for him to progress to the next cutscene. So, let's keep it up. Is that all you've got? To the skies. Oh, Eagle, you're still alive. God, I was gonna say. Oh, God. He's just flat on his back. Something wrong. Is this the height of your skill? You call yourself a god. Whoa. And you talk of sharing this world with me. Bloody hell. So that's why the dead boy is important to you. The homes are nothing but bacteria. Clinging to my body. Hey, we're your food, we thank are you. Living beings. If you cannot understand this, you have no right to call yourself a god. And who decides that? A god. <laughs> because only a god may decide. Take a shot every time he says God. This world only needs one god made of May you rot in that shell for all eternity. Whoa! Oh, Not Fiora right now. Like My god, if lucky not, I'm not taking a shot. Then say goodbye to your putrid friends! I'd be drunk as all hell. Zanza! Oh, Lady Maiden! She's come out of her shell too! Hot damn! Such a fool. This is what I wish. This oh, world no. belongs to She's you. She's giving her life. Create a world. With goosebumps, man. Gods. <laughs> Actual goosebumps. I wasn't expecting this to play out like it has. Oh. <sighs> 
Now what do we do? We've got no hope here. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is the passage of fate. Zenza, disappear. Yep. He's gone. He's fucked up. Things ain't looking good for us. What the hell do we do now? <laughs> Let it begin. The ceremony of destruction and recreation. Where is he? Oh, he's back in uh Prison Island. Uh oh. Life as we know it. Holy shit. Oh my god. That's terrifying. The, the Bionis. Thank god we're not Hurt. there. What's happening now? I'm sorry. I was. I understand. I always knew it might come to this. She was just trying to save you. Go, Vanea. Do what you must. While there is still time remaining. All hope is not lost. Are you sure? No. Oh god, the thing's you exploding. Must come with me. I too have something that I must do. The final wish trusted to me by Lady Mayneth. Oh, brother. Melia? I understand your feelings. Leave it to us. We know what we must do. We will do all we can for the people of Maconis. Uh, now go. Shulk can still be saved. Really? <laughs> do not let. The last I died years ago. Be extinguished. Thank you. Go in peace. Let's go. Where's Leaving Dixon gone? And Elvis too. What's his Got role it. in all this? Ah, uh, you okay? Yes. And she's free now. Good. It still works. The whole place is gonna blow. We must return to Junks via the central factory. Let's go. Thundern, what about Egil? Nothing we can do for him. He'll fight Zanza to the very end. But we have our part of the bargain. Once he's gone, we're the only ones left. Let's move, everyone. Where are we going? Goodbye, my brother. <laughs> What's our plan? Have we got a plan? Or are we just running around like headless chickens? Shulk is just a guest. <laughs> Shambling along like the zombie he is. Okay, well, let's get out of here then. <clears throat> I suppose the first order of business is we get out of here before it explodes. So... I mean, there's that, but th oh man, there's so much to unpack from that. Freaking Shulk was dead, inhabited by Zanza, who I, this whole time I thought was uh, the giant purple guy, but no, it's actually freaking Liquid Snake, and oh god, Lady Maynith just gave her life to save us, the two of them, gods, Eggles dying, <laughs> let's get out of here. Can I even fast travel? No, I can't. Oh man, we truly are in the end game now. First, we gotta take down Dixon. Find out what Alvis's role in all this is. What about the woman as well? The one that fights alongside uh, High Inchia? I need to know what her role in all this is. Is Dixon even the harms? Like, because when there was like that little flashback and Eggle recognized him, there was another uh, purple dude. Oh, I'm assuming it was purple, considering the flashback was monochrome. 
Junks, we're here! Don't take off without us! I'm surprised this place isn't, like, exploding in the background and we have to, like, leap and do platforming. We made it back! Come on! Evacuate! Retreat! Mikko! The job's half done, do we get paid? Looks like it's all over. Yep, I know even though I wasn't there. I want to thank you for what you did for my son. But we have to escape here first. Shall we go back to the village? Uh, well, I don't think there's anything we can do here, so let's go back. I could be mistaken, of course. Our great escape. The Mechonis may very well be no more. So desperate to cling to your pathetic lives. Even when there is no hope for you! Oh god. Oh. Hegel. Beast. Don't you ever give up! <laughs> I just wanted to see the look on your face before you kill me. Never. But hear this, Zanza. They will judge me not in life, but death. Yeah! He just wanted to piss you off before he died. Oh, damn. Disemboweling him. Uh-oh. Here we go. Die! Hey, go! Carved in half. Wow. Shulk. For both our worlds, you must succeed. Lady Thank you, Echo. If only Shulk could hear you. Oh my god. Damn. Yeah. Thank you. I mean, Let's stop it. Good God. What's that cloud? What's this now? Telethia? It's Telethia. Oh, God. Why now? Oh, Dixon, you bastard. You're not getting away. Dixon! Listen, it's over. Time for you all to return to the Bionis. Nice and quietly. That's enough! Why, Dixon? What made you like this? Shulk looked up to you, respected you. Dixon! Don't let Zanza control you! Wake up! You can quit your belly aching. I mean, total control. <laughs> I've always been like this. Ever since long before any of you lot were born. Yeah, he's been around a while. He's seen some things. Before we were born. Now you get it. It's just like Egil said. He's older than he looks. I'm Lord Zanza's disciple. Dixon of the Trinity! Oh. Okay, Dixon of the Trinity. I guess we're gonna have to take you on. 